the foot of the mountain they all come to see Glen Bay, Glen Carr, they made history Downing the Rangers, our young team of men Brought joy to the homes of our glorious glens After 36 years of heartbreak and pain Kings of Mid Kerry, we were crowned once again The O'Connor Cup is now where it belongs And the glens are alive with the yarns and the song from Blackstone's Bridge to Ross Bay's Blue Sea and back to the village through Curragee. These days are the greatest that we've had by far. So thanks to the heroes of Glen Bay Glen Carr. In 75, when the cup was last seen, there were stars such as Healy, Reardon and Breen. Captain Michal Griffin, he raised the cup high. Heroes one and all, no man can deny. Kevin Griffin now has a medal, the same as his son, as has our own Connie O'Sullivan. Back to back champions, those cups they were sealed with hard fought wins over the proud men of Kiel. Now, sadly, some of that legend. Side. Watch this year's final from way on up high Jerry Mike, Ned, Brian Coffey, Pat Murphy too The 2011 win is dedicated to you From Gladstone's Bridge to Ross Bay's Blue Sea And back to the village through Curry These days are the greatest that we've had by far So thanks to the heroes of Glen Bay Glen Carr with a team laced with youth, but experience too The new chairman Roach sensed what the seniors could do And two O'Grady Golds floored Milltown Castlemaine As the march from the Glens gathered pace yet again Alas, for clash with Beaufort awaited And the parish's excitement carried on unabated Late points from O'Connor and McKenna to boot in short, all the hard work had finally borne fruit. From Blackstone's Bridge to Ross Bay's Blue Sea And back to the village through Curragee These days are the greatest that we've had by far So thanks to the heroes of Glen Bay Glen Carr And so to the day in Beaufort's driving rain An hour would decide either failure or fame Patter, Kieran and Patrick who read out the names of the men who do battle with Lone Rangers again. Peter O'Sullivan and goals he would toil in front the full backs of Walter and Doyle. Kilkenny and Murphy were ready to soar alongside Griffin Glen Bay to the core. In the middle stood giants who would dictate the game McGillicuddy and O'Connor would eventually reign The O'Sullivan trio, Darren, Danny and Chris Half forward united, this chance they'd ne'er miss McKenna, O'Grady, Hula and Free Faced up to their date with destiny But the town by the loud were well able to hustle With danger man like lethal mighty Frank Russell from Blackstone's Bridge to Ross Bay's Blue Sea And back to the village through Curragee These days are the greatest that we've had by far So thanks to the heroes of Glen Bay Glen Carr The Rangers started brightly as men they did fall But points from old Grady helped his teammates stand tall At the half-time whistle the game it did cease with the scoreboard showing five points apiece. Captain Raymond O'Connor, he led with some style as fans in red and black, they started to smile, leading ten points to nine with only minutes to go. Could we hold on? The Rangers thought no. But throughout the year, the Suds had been key like Rory O'Connor, Roach and Kieran Courtney. As Jared the Bomber grew nervous on air, a joy shot wide in a wicked gold scare. With four minutes left, the gods they did smile on our gallant men who showed courage and guile. 
Lions stop Captain Raymond's rocket, but he couldn't stop Courtney finishing to the net. Gavin O'Grady, is he going to go long inside? Into a long volley, goes Raymond O'Connor. Up there, eyes are going inside. Raymond, brilliant stop, finish, goal! Goal for Jeffrey Dinkow! Goal for Jeffrey Dinkow! Will that be the goal that will bring the cup back to Dinkow for the first time in 26 years? So to Raymond and Co from the mighty Glencar, Glen Bays, Gavin and Darren, our golden old star, each one of the squad will forever be known as the boys who brought the O'Connor Cup home. From Blackstone's bridge to Ross Bay's blue sea and back to the village through Curry, these days are the greatest. That we've had by far, so thanks to the heroes of Glen Bay Glencar. Kieran Courtney has it, Kieran Courtney is pulled there, back to Bernard Murphy, trying to hold on to the ball. Gavin O'Grady, it's all over! It's all over! Glen Bay Glencar are the St. Amit Kelly champions, worth 2,000 in a left way shape. From Blackstone's British Ross Bay's blue sea, and back to the village through Curry. These days are the greatest that we've had by far, so thanks to the heroes of Glenbay Glencar, champions of Mid Kerry, Glenbay Glencar.